What's up, everybody? So, it is my lunch time. Oh, I'm trying to get comfortable in the car. I'm trying to get comfortable. Lunch time. First thing I gotta do is text my girlfriend. Turn on my lunch. Oh, man, I got 10 messages from my mom. That's a lot of messages, mom. So how are you guys doing? How's your guys' day going? What are you doing right now? I'm actually, I'm like genuinely curious. Um, hold on a second, I gotta text my girlfriend. Um, I'm genuinely curious what you guys are doing right now. I'm always wondering what people are doing on the opposite side of the camera. If it's nasty though, I don't wanna hear it. No, tell me, tell me all your stories. Tell me what you're doing. So, you guys care what I mean? So, these are lentil chips. Um, they're lentil chips, they just call them lentils. Lentils, crunchy lentil chips. Crunchy lentil chips, are they crunchy? Ooh, camera's shaking like crazy. Oh, because the car is on, mm. Mm, okay, I'll turn the car off, but I got the light on, don't wanna kill my battery. Mm, sorry, I was shaking you guys. You're like, man. The freaking car, sh the camera shaking so much. All right, all right. Um, I wish it didn't do that. Does it? I don't remember. I know. Mm. Crunchy lentil chips. They are crunchy. So I have that, and I have some um, deli roast beef. Deli roast beef. Natural choice. Hormel. Natural choice. I don't have any bread or anything to eat uh, with that. Remember, like I was telling you guys earlier, I don't really eat a lot of bread. Um, so I have that. Then, have some hummus to go with it. Kirkland hummus, that's from Costco, for those of you. See, every time I talk about like a brand or something, I always think, well, if you're from the United States, you probably know what it is, you know what Costco is. But if you're not from the United States, you might not know what Costco is. I don't know if Costco is worldwide. But anyhow, if you don't know what Costco is, it's um, a bulk food store, not food store, it's a bulk uh, It's a bulk item store where you can buy bulk items, you know, toilet paper, hummus. Um, I bought a box of like, I don't know, 30 or 24 or whatever, a bunch of hummus, little packs. You know, perfect for going for your lunch or whatever. Oh man, I don't have any water. <clears throat> I'm gonna choke, I'm gonna die on camera. If I die on camera, whoever finds this, you need to make sure you still upload this video be my my farewell to the world into YouTube. <clears throat> you guys watch me talk to death. I'll get some views, huh? A lot of thumbs up for all of you guys who hate me. Not everybody hates me though. Some of you guys like my videos. I'm giving me a thumbs up. I appreciate it. Matter of fact, thumbs up right now before you guys forget. I never really asked for thumbs up, but today I'm asking for a thumbs up. Thumbs up before you forget. Mm, let's check my phone. Let's see if the GF uh, wrote back. Yes. You guys want to know what she said? She said, okay, so I said, on lunch. If she's watching this video, she might get mad. I said, on lunch. She said, all right, what are you going to eat? And she said, there is chicken, brown rice, and green beans in the fridge for when I get home. That's nice, huh? That's nice. Um, what am I going to eat? I'm going to eat lentils, chips. I'm just going to tell her um, lentil chips. Lentil chips. Hummus, hummus, and meat, and lunch meat, lunch meat, meat, and then, so I told her, lentil chips, hummus, and lunch meat, and then I told her, and thank you for the dinner, thank you, I just put in thank you, I'm not gonna write all kinds, I only got 30 minutes, guys, I only got 30 minutes for lunch, oh, speaking of which, if you are from another country, how long is... Uh, a work lunch time in the United States or in where I live in the United States uh, break time is half an hour for your lunch okay like say our, our work day if you work full time it's 8 hours okay so if you work an 8 hour shift in California you're supposed to get 2 10 minute breaks what she wrote back she said that sounds good and no problem so you're supposed to get 2 10 minute breaks 
and one 30 minute break for your lunch and you work eight hours. So in your country, wherever country you're from, um, what's what's the break? I mean, do you get a half hour for lunch or 20 minutes, 45 minutes? What's your guys' lunch break? Where are you from? What's your lunch break? And also, I don't know if I finished my sentence earlier, but I'm curious what you guys are doing outside, other side of the camera. I wonder if you guys come back to after you give me a thumbs up. I like watching people go to my work. Okay, time to eat the meat. Just like that, I suppose. Mm. Mm. It's okay. It'd be better with bread. Ooh, maybe with hummus. Now I can't really use my phone because my fingers are all dirty. Hummus with lunch meat. I'll let you guys know how that is. Not the best thing I've ever had in my life, but it's edible. Okay, let's see what the girlfriend said. I spit it on my phone. Dang it. It's not even recognized my fingertips. Uh oh. Oh boy. Battery low, 14%. So, girlfriend didn't write me back. I would tell you what my mom said, but she'd probably get mad if she found out that I was telling her. Why are you telling people on YouTube what I say? Uh, not gonna do that. Um, well, I just eat my lunch. This video is gonna be kind of long. Hopefully, my battery doesn't die. Turn that light on. More hummus with meat. Five. Had my eggs in this way earlier. All I had was like chips and salsa for lunch. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna drink. I want Coca Cola so bad, but it messes me up. And there's Diet Coke, but one, I don't want the artificial sweeteners, you know, the Spartame or whatever else is in, in diet drinks. That's one thing that I don't like. And two, I don't know if it messes me up still. Like, with food, I get two problems. I always say it, it messes me up, but what I mean is, I get one. When I eat something, like say corn, okay, I get one or two problems. I get digestive problems, or I get neurological problems, like being sleepy or irritable or things like that. So, corn, mostly digestive problems. If I eat corn, I shit my brains out. I'm not gonna hold back on on words right there, but like with other foods, it might cause the neurological problems. And so, when I have Coca Cola, it has a lot of sugar. Okay, and um, any, if I eat anything with a lot of sugar, I get the neurological problems, like a diabetic would. You know, that's why I think that I'm diabetic. You know, like I get like uh, the foggy brain or fuzzy brain, whatever you call it. You know, I can't think straight and stuff like that. Like when you really tired, like lethargic and all that kind of stuff. So I, I love Coke. I really, I mean, you guys have no idea. Coke, I love Coca-Cola. If I had a Coca-Cola right now, oh my God, I'd be so happy. But, I said I drink it. I'm going to go foggy your brain. And that's because, assuming I'm diabetic, my blood sugar goes to the freaking roof. And... You know, it's not good. Well, that's why it messes up your body. So anyway, they have Diet Coke. Okay. And I worry about Spartame, the artificial sweeteners for the long-term effects, right? But, um, even short-term, I don't know if that will cause neurological effects. Because, like I said, I don't know if I'm, um, sensitive to caffeine. I still don't know that. It seems like when I have caffeine, I experience neurological problems too. Oh, I'm all messed up. Tony, for all you young kids out there, if any young people watch my videos, hold on. Mm. Mm. Well, anybody, right? Not just a young kid. Anyway, I learn from my mistakes. Um, 
you know, I'm not going to tell you to not eat certain foods. Like, oh, never drink soda or never, you know, eat candy or uh, greasy food. Nothing. I'm not going to tell you that. I'm not going to tell you that. Because that's not good advice. You know, you have to enjoy life and you have to enjoy food. But, in moderation. Eat those foods in moderation. That's why I messed up. You know, I go to a fast food place, right? And I get my drink, my Coca-Cola, or whatever drink I get. And instead of just drinking maybe, you know, a small drink, or even a good large drink. I'm just having that one large drink. No. So over here in the United States, we have free refills. I don't know if they have um, that in other countries. You know, you buy a drink, say a 32-ounce drink, whatever, right? Once you finish the drink, you can refill your cup for no extra cost. And so I would take advantage of that. Oh, free refills. I get two refills, three refills. So I'm sitting here drinking like a half a gallon of soda in one sitting. Which is obviously very bad. And eventually it took a toll on my body, eating all that sugar. And, you know, um, one of the food places I go to, they have um, half a pound of fries on sale sometimes. Half a pound, right? And it would be like 99 cents for a half pound of fries, which is really good. Okay? So sometimes I get like two half pounds of fries or something like that. So it's not just indulging in food you like in food you like, it's overindulging, over overindulging. And it throws your body into a ruckus, you know, and it's not good. And so, you know, when you're younger or whatever, if you're not thinking about it, you're not thinking about it. And later on, when it hits you like, oh, I should have listened. I should have listened to Matt. I should listen to whoever, your mom, your dad, your brother, whoever, you know, friends. You know, so listen. You know, indulge, you know, have things you like, whatever it is, you know. I mean, unless you're doing heroin or something, just don't do that. But, um, don't overindulge. You know, don't overindulge. Oh, food's done, by the way. Yeah, don't overindulge. Moderation, it's all about moderation, you know. And like I said in my other video, don't go vegan. Don't have that diet where you totally eliminate things. Oh, I'm not going to eat meat, or I'm not going to eat cheese, or I'm not going to eat bread completely, you know. Only reason I don't eat bread, really, is because I can't, you know. I'm, I get sick from, like, everything I freaking eat. But that's what happens when you do that elimination diet. But I'm not going to get into that again. Um, but, yeah, moderation, man. That's the key. I'm telling you. Don't don't um, eat too little or too much, you know. Even, like, something like salt. Obviously, you don't eat a whole bunch of salt. You get heart problems, heart disease, all that stuff. But even too little salt. Don't be like, okay, well, salt's bad. I'm not going to have any salt. No, no, that's not good either because... Um, Salt dissolved in liquid is electrolyte. That's why I see in the United States, anyways. There's a lot of drinks. Um, they say, oh, it contains electrolytes. That's all electrolyte is, and you know it helps um, not circulation in your body. It helps like uh, electrical functioning in your brain, your body, and stuff like that. You know, and so if you completely don't have salt, that can cause problems too. So that's my point. You know, everything in moderation. Anyhow, this video is probably like I don't know, seven, ten minutes long. So I'm gonna get going. I'm going to turn off this light. I'm going to turn off the camera. I'm going to turn off the light. But okay. Thank you guys for joining me in my lunch. Whatever you're doing on your side of the planet. But um. I was going to say have a good night. But it might not even be night wherever, where you're at. It could be morning. It could be whenever. Or maybe you. Maybe you're on the international. Maybe you're an astronaut. And you're on the international space station. So it's not even day or night. It's just daytime all the time. Because you're outside of earth. And the sun is just always there. Imagine if an astronaut watched my video. Wouldn't that be pretty freaking cool? Yeah, that's not going to happen. Astronauts, they watch like big YouTubers. I'm just rambling. I'm going to let you guys go. So you guys can go do whatever you do. Thank you for whoever watched this video this long. Thank you. Because a lot of people probably saw like a minute or 30 seconds of the video and said, This guy's dumb. This guy's ugly. And he's dumb. I'm not that ugly though. I just got a fresh, a good haircut. I'm looking fresh. I look good. So thank you guys to whoever stayed thumbs up to you. Don't thumbs up to just me. Thumbs up to you for watching. Yeah. Yeah.